My name is Mark Urselli. I'm a uh, producer and engineer based in New York and London. Uh, behind me, you see Eastside Sound, which is the studio where I'm chief head engineer at uh, in New York City. Um, that, that's where I do most of my records. I work primarily in the fields of jazz, punk, rock, uh, some classical music. The design of the microphone is absolutely stellar. I mean, the fact that it's a, a magnetic mount uh, means that you don't have to use a microphone stand. Uh, it means that you don't have to worry about the microphone uh, moving. Uh, not that the piano is, a, is an instrument that would move very much away from the microphone position like it, like it could happen if you were recording a string, uh, you know, a violin or a guitar or whatever. Uh, but it still is very helpful that the, the piano, that the microphone will stay in exactly the position you put it in without ever moving and most importantly, without ever rattling. I think the Remic uh, P6100 is going to be a winner live. Uh, I think it's going to be really where the microphone shines and where the versatility of the design, and the ability to close the lid will greatly increase the chances of having a piano sound without all that leakage. I can't wait for concerts to be back and for me to have the choice to test this, but I think the ability to close the lid and, and reduce all the leakage is going to be really a killer uh, game changer. Uh, in the studio, I, I don't think they can, uh, they can be used as the only mic, uh, just because they don't have the uh, low end response by, by just the design of being a small a miniature condenser versus a large diaphragm condenser. But if you use them in conjunction with a pair of large diaphragm condensers or a pair of fur, you know, spaced out microphones away from the piano, then I think you can really get a beautiful sound with a, with a very wide stereo image and a very defined uh, mid-range because the remix really help with the mid-range uh, focus on the image.